Good evening, crypto world. It is 8.38 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Halloween. Scary. Right now, up and down the East Coast, gusty wind, especially in the Northeast. 50 miles an hour with a front going through. And it is crazy loud out there. But anyway, you've got this all in one in front of you. Take a look at it. Because Apollo is setting crypto history, has with the sharding event, um, which is coming up the second sharding piece, and first database sharding done by Apollo, along with the updater, which prevents forks in the 51% attack on the POS network. And it's not a piece of shit network, it's a POS network. Proof of stake. The, <laughs> the all in one in front of you, you look at the dominance. Go to the left side first, and you see all those features. And I'll, Apollo has, look at the bottom, one to two seconds, versus the rest that are out there. But then we get to the speed over here on the right. But you see all those features. Apollo, that's why they're the all-in-one, and nobody can even come close. And you look at the speed right here, one to two seconds going to sub-second soon. Okay, which is amazing when you do wallet to wallet transfers. And then you've got the privacy features that are immense. But keep in mind, this is a public option always with Apollo's network, not just private. So you have all that there. Okay, then on top of that, remember, this is the all-in-one. Now, coming up in just three days, Monday, November 4th, a huge... They say major Africa, Apollo Africa announcement. Now keep in mind this Apollo Africa initiative is national currency. That's what they've been doing for months, many months now, um, and partnered with the ADF group. So this is coming up Monday. This is going to be the stepping stone into crypto history. Um, one of the first of many pieces they'll, they'll be doing. And in my opinion, sooner or later, could be very soon, could be later but you're going to have national currency done um, with Apollo hosted with their blockchain on some and then doing an, a legal tender on others uh, so you got all that coming so that is huge news coming my opinion you've got the market at 242 billion almost 243 25 billion for the daily BTC 9168 ETH 182 XRP 29. Market's been in a slight little down click. Um, so you've got that happening. What the? F no, I'm just joking. <laughs> Pre Brexit, Coin wins e money license from UK's FCA, now seeking Luxembourg, UAE, US permissions. Digital asset custodian, Coin Money LTD, has secured an electronic money license from UK regulators while it pre prepares for the future Brexit. Hey, Brexit. On Thursday, they've gone through, you can see they can basically, they're trying to get everything all set. And it's going to happen because they're doing the right things, doing it ahead of time. Um, so that will be something to watch. Then you've got the season of Halloween, seeps into blockchain gaming. Dun, 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 dun. You've got Crypto Kitties is back this year with more Halloween themed cats that you can breed. Blockchain Cutie, CTH, and NEO, Tron EOS. You've got them. Crypto Space Commanders. You've got them. Keep in mind this too. If you download, 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 download Aircoins. Aircoins has Apollo's coin on it, along with a bunch of others. And go out there in the dark on Halloween night and try to find the coins. Just don't get hit by a car. You've got all these other ones here. On this list as I go slowly down here so if you're in the mood to do a bunch of these different games there's a ton of them and that's about it for that one so now let's get over to this you've got the volume of crypto futures trades is catching up to spot trading it is when you do this research that they did with the 13 exchanges analyzed um, including back Mercantile Exchange Group, CME, Binance, Bitfinex, Hobi Derivative Market, Kraken, FTX, Blitz, or Bits, Derivit, CoinFlex, Bybit, 
OKEX and BitMEX. So that's pretty impressive that that's happening. You've also got Crypto Mom. She's still doing it. She's out there. She's calling for safe harbor for crypto entrepreneurs at the SFBW. Um, so Hester Pierce, she's always, well, you know, put a, put a, keep in mind this. Put this into perspective, perspective of Crypto Mom. That's her handle. Well, guess what? SEC having that and she's there. Perfect. Okay, this isn't perfect. When you have the city of Johannesburg, computer networks is under attack from the ransomware extortionist. And not just the, the city, individually hacked banks. And this one here is a couple days old. I am not going to click on that to find out about that site. No. Um, but I'll tell you this, it could probably is back up again. But if it isn't, it is the severity of this type of hack. But I'm in tech, and I'll tell you one thing, it's easy to protect against these things. When I say easy, easy. You do a system restore backup, and when you do that, and these come into you, you can shut the machine off, the network off, go into what they call the safe mode, do the restore function, and then you all have get rid of that Bitcoin crap. There are ways to do it with hard resets and a bunch of others. Proof of work doesn't solve every blockchain use case. It No, it doesn't. When you look at what proof of work is, Bitcoin ETH, you look at what the proof of stake is for Apollo, so much more advanced. Then they're talking about in this article where they have the limitations of each, but then they talk about going into, you know, doing some different things. Guess what? Apollo is going to wake this freaking market up. Why? Because they're doing the fastest, most private. They got the all-in-one features. They've got sharding done that nobody could do. E ETH tried to do it. Nobody could do it. Apollo did it. Apollo's going to the DAG consensus protocol next year. And that is the most advanced in that, including the Apollo cloud, along with TPS over a million. Ding dong. Okay, so remember how this video started breaking news of the time clicking down Apollo's in Africa pushing national currency Apollo has all this stuff can you see where I'm going here okay getting into the Swiss based securities daily charged by SEC and CFTC for failing to register a security based swaps unfortunately there so first global credit well <laughs> I laughed at the these predictions the prophecy of Asuka, Asuka. Um, do you think we'll see $7,000 of a jump in Bitcoin in the next, let's say, three hours to have this prediction come true, the prophecy? I don't think so. Um, these wild predictions, yes, I'm not going to get involved in it. Just put it this way. Predictions don't work. Um, really, they don't. <laughs> they don't. Okay. Bitcoin needs real use cases to become digital gold. The people that make these comments usually aren't, how can I put it? They're not fully versed. Sure, they'll take in some consideration of what's going on for Bitcoin over the last few years. But again, they make comments like this for headlines. It's garbage. Bitcoin has been used for daily use cases. When you load up your Bitcoin onto a debit card, you're using Bitcoin for daily use on goods and services. That There's no way to deny that that's Bitcoin. You've loaded it up and it's there. Same thing with any other coin that you can send to those uh, debit cards. So just archaic. Sure, could it be more simple like with BAKKT and doing their app that's coming out? Yeah, going to Starbucks, get the coffee easily, doing it up. But again, a crypto debit card, you're using your cryptos. Um, Binance rumored to be planning new office in Beijing and first presence in China because of China's changing ways with blockchain and their thoughts. Yeah, I can see why he's doing it. CZ, when you look at what's going on with Apollo, and this channel has a lot of information 
on Apollo. If you're new to Apollo, this is massive news coming up because they have been there for many months, partnered with the ADF group, and guess what? Things are gelling for the Apollo people's currency. Lives are going to be made better in Africa and other countries when Apollo goes around with a 0% inflation currency and their endless featured blockchain. They are going to take care of business. The devs are taking care of business of getting a new release soon to update the decks and more, um, a lot more. The devs don't stop. They have a lot going on. And when you look at the partnership that's uh, with the ADF, that's invaluable, as I've said. The, the world will know Apollo. It's taking time for that to happen. But now that these big things are really starting to cook, just wait till next week. That's all I got to say. If a government announces Apollo, now it's not if, it's, it's when a government announces Apollo as a digital currency backup host or national currency legal tender blockchain use complete with the government cross-border trade this is what you got to understand when the government announces it the press of that country world if it's big like national currency world press is going to be talking to the government and Apollo Africa with the ADF group. Huge. Part of the thing that they're doing with now with the three exchange platforms, the Apollo Dex getting better and better as time goes on. Currently, you can exchange Ethereum and Paxos Stablecoin is built in to cash out to your bank. But you also have the advanced trading platform that they're building, an instant buy and sell platform, plus two trading apps. All this is coming on the new website. Um, that they have coming out in the rebranding. And these exchanges will let them work their magic in Africa to have fiat from banks of the central banks and the people that have the accounts fiat loaded up into these exchanges to buy. Apollo's partnership letter, huge. This started the initiative back many months ago, huge. She can sit back and watch her investment grow. That is a ticket with Apollo. And to the moon and beyond, why? Because this coin has done everything in the last year and a half to put the package together and make it the best in crypto. And there is no hype on that. So Steve's comment at the bottom. Also, we are planning the Africa announcement on the 4th. We are excited to share what we have done. They are excited. Him and his partner, Willie, are very excited. And that shows you what's what. Set up as a brain. Can you see that? <laughs> yeah. With a circuit board. Yeah, working. Apollo Africa. This continent is going to be shaken up in a good way by Apollo. With a 0% inflation set up, they are going to have so much better lives in the hyperinflation countries in Africa. And this office in this location for the ADF in South Africa, for the Apollo Africa, right in the same building as this gentleman, the CEO of ADF. They are making crypto history. So let's all cheers the Apollo Knots. And right now you can get involved too. It's only 0 0.001. Yeah. And it's at Bitmart, IDAX Pro, System Coin, Digifinex, Altili, and soon LA tokens. And I may have forgotten one. That is the future right there. And it's just going to be a rush to watch it happen. This buy and sell platform that they're doing with these centralized exchanges, it's going to be huge also. And the community of Apollo, that is just what it is. The Apollo community is super strong. They're excited. And there's good reason for it. Monday is coming fast, very fast. Altilly's there for you too. Fast Apollo is coming. And that is what the devs are working on, along with a bunch of other stuff.
So everybody have a great one. Any breaking news I'll have it for you um, in three more hours. Um, well, this video will be up by about, I would say, at the latest 10 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Will Bitcoin search while you start watching this video and tomorrow? 7K. I hope it does. I really do hope it does. I hope there is a market turnaround. That would be nice. But I'll tell you one thing. The weekend leading up to this event and then what's going to happen afterwards as the world hears about Apollo and what they're doing in Africa, this is going to be huge. Apollo will be the news. And ladies and gentlemen, I can't wait for that to happen. I really can't. It's a great road to be on.